Hello friends, this video on coordinate geometry part 13 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 12. You have to find the area of the triangle formed by joining the midpoints of the sides of the triangle whose vertices are 0, minus 1, 2, 1 and 0, 3. Also, we have to find the ratio of this area to the ratio of the hair. Let's have this as the triangle. This be triangle A, B, C, and the vertices are all right here. Zero comma minus one. This is this is two comma one, and C is zero comma three. First, we have to find the midpoint of this. These vertices we find, right? So this is nothing but A plus C by two. This is zero. This is zero. Zero plus zero by two. Let's suppose this is B, E, and F. Correct? So you can say that B is nothing but A plus C by 2. First, you to find the midpoints. If we have this point, we can find the area of this triangle. We can, we can find the area of this triangle and we can divide to get the answer. So D is nothing but A plus C by 2. So D of X will be 0 plus 0 by 2. That is 0 plus 0 by 2 and that is 0. Similarly, d of y will be y of this is minus 1 and this is 3. This is minus 1 plus 3 by 2. That is 2 by 2. That is 1. So, d point is 0 comma 1. Similarly, let us find the uh, point E. E is nothing but c plus b by 2. Correct? Because midpoint of this. So, E of x will be, this is 0, this is 2, so 0 plus 2 by 2, that is 1, that is 1 comma, E of y will be 3 and 1, 4 by 2, that is 3 plus 1 by 2, that is 4 by 2, that is 2, this is 2. Similarly, you can find the value of f, f will be a plus b by 2 f is nothing but right here, f is nothing but a plus b by 2. So, f of x you have to find nothing but 0 plus 2 by 2, 0 plus 2 by 2, that is 1, 1. And f of y you have to find is equal to minus 1 plus 1 by 2, that is 0. So, we have all these points. Now, just we have to find the area of the triangle ABC and triangle DEF. So, let us find triangle area ABC. So, triangle ABC, if you see the points are x, y, you take this. So, we can use this formula x uh, 0 or write like this x1, y1, x2, y2, x3, y3. And again x1 y1, right? So let's write like this x y 0 minus 1 this point, 2 1 is this point, 0 3 is this point, and again 0 minus 1. Correct? And the whole thing we have to divide by 2. So let's find the area. It is nothing but 1 by 2 into this one. 0 into 1 is 0 plus 2 into 3 is 6 plus this is 0. 0 into minus 1 is 0, right? Minus, minus 1 into 2 is minus 2 plus 1 into 0 is 0, 3 into 0 is 0. So this becomes 1 by 2 into 6 minus minus 2 is 6 plus 2, that is 8 by 2, and that is 4 units. So this is the area of triangle ABC. Similarly, now let us find the area of triangle DEF. D, E, F, and this three points, you can find the area of this triangle. So, this will be again, let us write this points x1, y1, x2, y2, x3, y3, and x1, y1 again. So, in this case, let us start with this point 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 2, and 0, 1. 
So what we'll get the area is nothing but 1 by 2 into let's take this side 0 into 0 is 0 plus 1 into 2 is 2 plus 1 into 1 is 1 right minus 1 into 1 is again 1 1 into 0 is 0 and 2 into 0 is 0. So that is nothing but 1 by 2 into 3 minus 1 that is 1 by 2 into 2 and that is 1. So area of this and area of this is 4 and the area of smaller triangle is 1. So ratio is nothing but ratio is 1 is to 4. The ratio of smaller triangle with the bigger triangle. Correct? And that is what we are asked. That is ratio of area of DEF by area of ABC is equal to 1 is to 4. Let's take one example. Find the area of the quadrilateral whose vertices are given minus 4 minus 2 minus 3 minus 5 3 minus 2 and 2 comma 3. I will not solve this question. I will tell you the approach how to solve this question. This is a quadrilateral A, B, C, D and these points are given minus 4 minus 2 minus 3 minus 5 and this is 3 minus 2 and this is 2 comma 3. To draw any diagonal, what you can see that there are two triangles, triangle and triangle 2. So area of the quadrilateral ABC is nothing but area of triangle 1 plus area of triangle 2. And we have all the points given. We can find the area of triangle ADC, the first triangle and triangle ABC. Right? Because see, if you see this area of triangle, this is A. B, C. Here also all the points are given. And the second triangle which we get is A, C. Here also all the points are given. So we have two triangles where all the points are given. We can use the formula to find the area of the triangles. Once we have the area of the triangles, we can find the area of the quadrilateral. You can try this on your own. It's a very simple question. We'll take one more example. We have to prove that the coordinates of the center to the triangle with vertices a, B and C are x1 plus x2 plus x3 by 3 and y1 plus y2 plus y3 by 3. I'll solve this question. Solve this, let's take this triangle and they are the uh, medians actually and this O is the centroid of the triangle. So A is x1, y1, B is x2, y2 and C is x3 y3. and we have to find the coordinates of this point O. So once we know that, see since this is the midpoint, let me point this point D, E and F. D is the midpoint of B and C. So D is nothing but B plus C by 2. So Dx will be nothing but x2 plus x3 by 2 is x2 plus x3 by 2 and dy will be y2 plus y3 by 2 y2 plus y2 by 2 correct we have got this point b we have got this point d as nothing but x2 plus x3 by 2 and y2 plus y3 by 2 this is the point d now we know that the median of the triangle divides this line is 2 is to 1 ratio. This fact we know. From geometry we know that the median, the, the centroid actually divides the median the ratio 2 is to 1. Now this is again now a question, different question, now it's a simple question now you see. This is a simple question, this is point A, this is point D, this is point O. This is 2 is to 1. We have this point D A as x1, y1, and this we have point D as x2 plus x3, y2, and y2 plus y3, y2. We have to find the point O. If you see this, this is 2 is to 1. You want to find this point O, you can use the same formula 2 multiply with this. 1 multiply with this d points and divide by 2 plus 1. So for this point O, you want to find the 
x what will get 2 into this is x1 actually x1 plus 1 into this one sorry this is 2 is to 1 this side if you see observe this carefully this is a mistake on my part this is 2 is to 1 ao is 2 and od is 1 so this will become 1 into x1 plus 2 into x2 plus x3 by 2 divided by 2 plus 1 this comes out to be x1 plus x2 plus x3 divided by similarly oy you get as nothing but 1 into y1 plus 2 into y2 plus y3 right y2 plus y3 divide by this is divided by 2 the whole thing divides by 2 plus 1 correct divide by 2 plus 1 this is nothing but y1 plus y2 plus y3 by that's what we have to prove that this O point is x1 plus x2 plus x3 by 3 and y1 plus y2 plus y3 by 3 and we have proved this Similarly, you can take this point, this point also, you'll get OS same value. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors, and much more. Thanks once again.